Since the beginning of history, people have reported sightings of ghosts in their homes and other locations. Having grown up in what I believe to be a haunted home myself, I have decided to interview people who have had other paranormal encounters. Now, it's not just your average Joe who has had a paranormal encounter. One of our very own local TV personalities experienced something very strange when he was holidaying in Malta. My first paranormal encounter was quite a few years ago on the island of Malta. I was staying in the Imperial Hotel, which is one of the oldest hotels on the island, and I'd been there quite a few times before this incident happened and never had any problem. But this particular morning, I was sleeping in a garden room which had um, French windows out onto a lawn area. And uh, it was not full daylight, but you know, dawn had broken and there was like an opaque light coming in. You didn't need to switch a light on to see anything. And I awoke and was lying in bed and sort of was changing position and tossing and turning a bit. And then all of a sudden, out of the corner of my eye, at the bottom of my bed, I realized there were two nuns standing with their hands like this, looking down over me. And I thought, there are two nuns at the bottom of my bed. No, there's not. How did you feel when you saw these two nuns at the end of your bed? Well, I was starting to get a bit panicky at this stage and I turned over to lie on this side and closed my eyes and I was looking like this and the two nuns were still at the bottom of my bed. And as I turned round to thump the switch on the bedside table to turn the light on, which I didn't really need because it was broad daylight, the two nuns just turned like as if they were on casters like that and turned into the wall and they were gone. In the morning I decided to make a few inquiries and I went to reception and asked them a bit about the history of the hotel and what had it been used as during the war and they told me that it was used as a hospital during the war and it had been manned by nuns who did the nursing and looking, looked after the patients there. They were somehow imprinted on time. They didn't present themselves to me, they just happened to be there. And uh, as I say, I, I originally thought they were standing over the bottom of my bed, but I don't think they were standing over the bottom of the bed. They were standing over something that had been in the room uh, in a different time in a different place and uh, they didn't they didn't really see me they were looking down at whoever they were they had been looking after in wartime Malta Reincarnation is a central belief to so many religions around the world. So just allow yourself to relax. Deeply, deeply relaxed. I think it's time to leave this lifetime. 